But if you have a budding artist on your hands, cartoonist Eric Teitelbaum, co-founder, co co-creator yes. of Budum Budum Budum, the Pink Panther comic Love strip, <laughs> will be in Albuquerque next week, and he'll be here to teach art lessons. And Naomi Sandweiss supervises the University of New Mexico's Continuing Education Youth Program and has all the details for us. Hi, Naomi. Hi. Good morning. Welcome Good morning. back. Thank you. Well, let's talk about this program. Tell us what it is. It's awesome um, okay. to have a working cartoonist come and work with your kids mm -hmm. and have them uh, create their own cartoons and also learn the business side of cartooning wow. so they get to know where could this get published so they get to learn how to create the actual characters as well as to how to draw them absolutely That's he takes so cool. them from kind of working with characters they know already uh -huh. right. and oh, nice. then expanding upon that and creating their own characters which is creative and fun and um, it's a great way to use their brains during the summer. So and you never forget yeah. something like that. Absolutely. Yeah. You know, and I want to mention to viewers who don't know, Eric Teitelbaum has actually been involved with continuing education for several years. So let's, before we get into the actual program, tell us a little bit more about him. Well, um, as you said, he is a co-creator of the Pink Panther cartoon. Yeah, that's huge. Um, and he is, he's um, had cartoons in New Yorker magazine and, mm -hmm. and other places like that. And he's really committed to teaching youth art skills. So wow. he wants to get young oh, people yeah. inspired. Some of his works here on the screen. Yeah. Yeah, he wants to get young people inspired Aww. to use their creativity, to have fun, and um, he does that definitely in his programs. No doubt. What are some of the benefits that we can expect the children who attend the, your courses? What will, what will they get out of it? Yeah, well, they'll definitely learn skills. Okay. So they'll learn drawing skills mm -hmm. for sure. But then there's those skills that are intangible, right. things like confidence in mm -hmm. their abilities, um, the ability to get feedback on their work, and oh. also to be there's our artist, there's our artist <laughs> there Eric, um, and to be in a community of fellow artists yeah. who really kind of encourage each other. For someone to say, "That's really cool. I love your idea," mm -hmm. is a boost for a lot of kids. It is. I want to say what we. We're talking about on the commercial break I was saying you know I'm not a good artist and you said you know that's why something like this is so great yeah. because if you get that kind of negative feedback as a kid you might get discouraged as you continue to get older but it doesn't have to be that way if you give yeah. that positive reinforcement anybody can do anything because create there is no rule with creativity right mm -hmm. absolutely I mean the idea is here that kids are having fun mm -hmm. they're using their skills and um, you know, we are very much a visual society no where doubt. everything For is visual. Sure. So to be able to even understand so how to create visual concepts is a, a great skill to have. Yeah, I mean, you're an artist, you know that. I'm an artist and I started out at an early age and so I, I understand the benefits of, of having no fear. Hmm. Yeah. And that's kind of, that. basically this sounds like an amazing course and that sounds like where you'd, you'd want your kids involved in something like this at an early age. You get yeah. a jump on it. Definitely, and I think having a professional teach you as well, someone who's working in the field, mm -hmm. gives you a boost as well. Definitely, and be able to be able to grow up and say, oh yeah, you know, you know the Pink Panther, right? Well, the <laughs> co-creator actually taught me how to do art, and and I know a lot of parents out there are thinking this would be great for my kid, but how much does it cost? Right. It's $120. Oh, that's okay. um, okay, that's and that includes all supplies. Oh, so, that's a great point. Yeah, it really it's a it's a package where they can come in and not have to worry about supplies and just do the work. So and have they fun. Don't have to go shopping ahead of time Not and bring all. their own stuff. Oh, that's great. Everything is supplied. That's great. Yeah. Well, and I know that kids don't get as much in, in school in the way of art as they used to. In addition to cartoons, what other courses will will you guys be offering? Oh, yeah. We've got a whole host of courses. Okay. Everything from a clay camp where younger children, six to ten, get to do hands-on clay. Oh, fun. To wow. um, drawing classes for teens, to even an architecture and design program in cooperation with the School of Architecture at UNM where it's amazing. Um, these high schoolers create models and present them and oh, learn nice. the, the background of architecture in the field. Wow, so, so it goes beyond anything from comics to architecture. Yeah. Absolutely. New yeah. Horizons. Yeah, and you said something about adult classes as well, right? We do. We have Eric Teitelbaum is teaching an adult class nice. as well next week. Why so it's cartooning for everyone. So like you can imagine how like a teacher might want those skills sure. or even, you mm. know, any kind of field you can imagine. Those might be, you know, good Even Nikki Stanzione. Absolutely. <laughs> yeah. Even the known artist that I am. That's, that is really cool. I love 
love yeah. it. And I think that gives a lot of people great ideas of a way to start the summer on the right foot. With a little creativity. Absolutely. Yes. <laughs> Absolutely. And where can we go for more information? Um, you can visit our website okay. at dce.unm.edu. Okay. And, um, and or call our registration office at 277. 0077 and we can get all your information and get you signed up. How fun. Yeah, yeah. DC is easy to remember because DC Comics. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> correlation. Go. Gotta find the correlation. <laughs> Naomi, thank you so much. Thank I'm you. Really, I'm going to look into this. This sounds fun. Yeah, thank you for being here. Who knows? Maybe we'll all be I'll keep an eye on her. <laughs> Make sure she's she's putting pen to paper here. <laughs> you never know. You never know. It, it's, you're never too old to try something new. Absolutely. Exercise that brain and we'll be right back. Don't go away.